guys, we're back. Uh, after Caleb oh my reset goodness. the system. I, I mean, like, that's what happens when you're working with, like, old technology, man. You have to make, you have to it's make not sacrifices even, and it's, changes. It's not even that old. I just, this is I like mean, the only <laughs> other controller, and the select button's broke. And it's one of the one things about Nintendo, and especially Capcom, that always piss people off. Select button is pause. It's the start button. That is beyond ridiculously stupid. And I just cannot believe it. All right, but, so, I mean, yes, I 100% agree with your argument. But there's two big buttons on the machine that say power and reset, <laughs> and you had to touch neither of them. Well, okay, so, like, it, the uh, the uh, Super Nintendo controllers are weird because... I've immediately messed this up. Yeah, we gotta you did. Back. We gotta go back. Because the, the uh, inputs... You have to flip them upside down for either port. So, like, if you stick it in one way for first player, you have to flip it upside down the other way for two player. All right, you messed it up again. No, I didn't. Yeah, you did. I didn't. Yes, you did. You messed it up because you that that one is not supposed to be there. Yes, it is. No, it's not because look, can I can went like this and then this. Uh, you goodness. messed it up, not me. Your fault. All right, hold on, hold on, like two seconds. I know what I'm doing. I'm I immediately just got scorched. And, like, it burned my entire body. It was very graphic. It's messed up again, actually. No. This is you! Why can't we do this again? We did it right the very first time. Because <laughs> we're stressed. We just need to... We just need to breathe. <laughs> Alright, so... Yeah. And kick that. And kick it one more again. No. No. I've already messed it up. <laughs> no, I'm pretty sure you... No, I didn't. I don't know. I feel like people watching home are like, you're doing it wrong! Yeah. Yeah, it's messed up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. Well, of course, Mac, these pirates sure are smart. <laughs> yeah. These pirates sure do know how to tickle our fancy. <laughs> I don't know. I'm sorry for that joke, too. It was bad. Wait. I think I immediately <laughs> that. I did. I did. It's immediately ruined. Come on. Before we, If we die here, I'm going to be extremely mad. Oh, wait. Oh, sh oh, that was right. Yeah. There we go. That was accidental, but it was right. It's worth it because I don't have any lives left, so if we find any diamonds, I'm going to eat them. Oh, I picked up the grappling hook again. What are these? I feel like I should be able to dig, like, holes in the wall right here. Nah, bro. It's just... Well, I mean, maybe. It's all just dirt. Okay, so... Uh, we have to... Man, that just, like... We were doing so good too, man. Yeah, and you reset the system. I know. I just I can't get over it. It's just it's heartbreaking to me. It's ridiculous, but it's all right. All right, I, I'm trying to think of like how, what we did. Yeah, I had to come over here get the wooden plank. Oops, I I hit you <laughs> and took the banana. That is all That's entirely fine. my fault. I just need the plank so we can go back. Okay, I want this barrel. Okay, well you can't take it with you. I, just just, had to, I had to commit a quick murder. It, like, man, it bothers me that these guys can take the blocks, too. Ah, oh, that's my bad. I was trying to run away from my guy. Those, <laughs> run! Uh, now, those, now those cherries and bananas aren't there. I'm sorry. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, run! Leave him alone. This playthrough has been nothing but a disaster. I, okay, well, I made him mad. <laughs> well, he's angry with us. Eat uh, this. Well, that... Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Just eat the cherry. That, that was incredibly rude. Hold on, I gotta turn my phone back on silent. Eat the cherry. Now we're gonna get fucking copyrighted by ESPN. <laughs> <laughs> All right, plank down. This episode is not sponsored by ESPN. <laughs> Please do not ever watch the Super Bowl or anything else that comes on. Yeah. <laughs> right, it doesn't play on ESPN, does it? <laughs> All right. Uh, well, hold on. Yeah, you take the key because you had to use your grappling hook to get over. Did there. you? Did you grab that? Thing, the yeah, jewel? I, I grabbed the diamond. And why do you not have a life anymore? I think they're points. I don't think they're lives. I think the pink ones are life. But I don't know. I, don't I just know like how me and you are both extremely skilled at tight roping. We're just two dogs from the hood. <laughs> have you, I, you? They live in like the suburbs. So like it's I mean, like, I mean, Max has had a hard knock life growing up. I mean, yeah, because if you've ever seen any of the future movies, he like gets like real seen. 
So like he just like starts skateboarding all the time and like doing like, drugs. You know he is behind the scenes. He's like, fuck you, dad. He's like, I don't ever want nothing to do with you. And Goofy's like in an extreme stage of depression. <laughs> An extremely depressing Goofy movie. Yeah. Like the whole movie is just like Goofy sitting on the edge of his bed and the camera slowly zooming out and then like you see the time of day going backwards. Dude, it's like really? at the very end it's just Gorge. <laughs> That's just the very end of the movie. Well, Gorge. <laughs> My poor Maxie's done gone. <laughs> <laughs> poor Maxie. It's it's like an extremely goofy movie is like on par with like Rugrats in Paris for sadness. And oh, don't even don't even get me started. Dude, like if you want, if, if if you feel like you want to watch a depressing movie, watch Rugrats in Paris. If nobody else has seen it, I'm not spoiling it for you. But spoiler alert, you'll cry uh, a lot. Okay, well just kill me. That's <laughs> that's fine. I'll just die real fast. <laughs> I, I thought that's why you were doing that. It was for me to. I thought you was risking your own life to well, save others. I mean, I was doing it so that you'd get by, and then I got to start talking about the fucking... The saddest movie of all time. <laughs> yeah. Dude, like, it's like... It's, it's so sad. Like, like the part... Well, there's Alright, listen. Uh, spoiler alert, spoiler alert, spoiler alert, <laughs> if you haven't seen it. But there's a part where, like, they're at, like, a, a mother-son dance, and Chucky's mom's dead. Yeah, she's, like, been dead for, like, the whole series. Yeah, and so, like, Chucky's just, like, standing there. And they're playing, like, first off, they're playing, like, the saddest song they could play. <laughs> look, hey, look, look. Yeah, they play, like, a real sad, like, song to dance to. Chuck's looking around, and he's just, like, completely destroyed that everybody's dancing with moms. And then, like, like they're on the plane ride to go to fucking Paris. And he's looking out at the, at the, at the, at the skyline. The sky. And then, like, the song is playing. He's like, I want them all yeah. that last forever. <laughs> it's just, like, the saddest shit. And you're like, why would you do this to me, Nickelodeon? Yeah, why? it's like... And like, for, and he's like, he's seen his mom in the clouds. Yeah, like shapes of her. It's like the saddest stuff ever. It's like, who would even think that's an appropriate thing to sell to kids? I'm pretty sure I got my copy out of a fucking McDonald's. Uh, <laughs> like, you remember when you used to get those McDonald's movies out of like? No, uh, you don't remember that. <laughs> Since when did McDonald's sell entire movies? Bro, you don't remember... This guy just messed the puzzle up for me. <laughs> you know, the Ronald McDonald movies, man. No, I don't know. You don't ever remember those? I have no idea what you're talking about. Oh, my God. They were good. They were... I, yeah, I just, like, completely 180 the subject. I was probably wrong. We probably bought that... I guarantee rats. you did, because like, McDonald's <laughs> wouldn't just give away movies. <laughs> yeah, they did. This guy keeps messing up the puzzle. Yeah, they, they you got to kill them before they're dicks and kicking shit around. Well, I mean, that's kind of hard to do, and I'm alone. <laughs> you need to kick that block at him before he kicks it. I mean, he's already ruined the puzzle. You need to run up and kick both. Ah, the stump stopped me. Don't. Ah! This is oh the my god! <laughs> ah, continue, continue. Hey, it doesn't matter. I still can't play anyway. <laughs> Just try. Push as hard as you I've can. I've been trying, man. Like, I've tried everything in the world. I'm going to press them both. Okay. Okay, but McDonald's did used to give you life. <gasps> yes! That's what I needed. Dun, 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 I feel like this is already messed up, though. No, it's no, fine. No, it's fine. It. You got it. I uh, kick that one up. <laughs> I can't get that out of my head now, and I'm mad. You know what else? That I learned is like the scariest movie I've ever seen. What? The Johnny Depp version of Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory. Why is that scary? Oh my God, the Oompa Loompas are terrifying. They They're got, just like the same dude. Yeah, but CGI it's, it's, copied and pasted. Yeah, but he's actually that tall. It's one small middle-aged Indian man. <laughs> and so the fact that he's small is that what scares you? No, or? the the whole premise of the damn movie scares me. <laughs> It's fucking Willy Wonka, man. No, it's because they got Tim Burton to direct it. He had to make it dark. They're like, <laughs> what confuses me? Okay, first off, the Oompa Loompas. You need to kick it to the right. I know the Oompa Loompas. They sing in English. Right. They're like Augustus Gloop, and they all have like they all have like different pitches in their voice. But they're the same man, just copy and paste. I know, but listen to me. Get! <laughs> The rage is real, man. Oh my goodness. Okay, as I was saying, <laughs> I tried to get it first. 
<laughs> I definitely kicked it first. All right, what I was saying is... All right, Zach, you need to breathe, baby. We can't let, I, we can't it, let Goose Troop kick our asses, man. It is. We can't let it. Ah. Uh, Did yeah. I let him continue? We only have one continue. Why? <laughs> Just one continue. Why you only That's have all one you continue? Get. That's all you get is one. Okay, well, wow. the password's already put in. Yeah. So. Uh, let's hope you're back in. Oh, I am this time, man. This is, I told you, man. Level right. two. Level two, it's, it's a doozy. Okay, so anyway, as I was saying... Directed by Tim Burton, yada yada. The Oompa Loompas, they sing in English, right? Right. Then how come when Willy Wonka wants... They're his slaves, basically, first off, okay? Well, yeah. How come when Willy Wonka... All right, now, hold on. This needs to go. Yeah, it needs to go that way. When Willy Wonka wants him to come here, he looks up at the sky and goes... Bruh! And apparently that they're like, oh, we better go see what Willy wants. <laughs> Our master summons us. Yeah. But they speak 100% perfect English. I just got scorched. Yeah, so he can't just be like, hey, come here. I messed it up. You did. We was, we was on track to have a perfect run there. They're always in earshot. Wait, this needs to go like this. Wait, hold on. I know right. how it goes. Kick that one up. Kick no. that one up. Now, yes, yes. Oh, okay, yeah, that one. There They're always go. in earshot. There's so many of them. So he could just be like, hey. And they, they would literally be like, what? <laughs> but no, he looks up and goes, whoa, 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 and I think it's to demonize them or like make them feel like garbage I mean yeah pretty much but also uh you gotta think man he he always said he was like well I basically saved them from Oompa Loompa Land no. because that place was terrible it sucked and all they did was sit around all day and eat chocolate beans they didn't even eat chocolate that's, just that's, the coca beans that's my next thing that is like their god what the coca beans or yes. Willie? No, the coca beans. He said they praise the coca beans, right? Right. And that's what he pays them in. Yeah. So he's 100% profiting off of them. Well, yeah. Okay. I, I mean, they are basically slaves because they just lay, they live in the factory. And, you know... Ah! I, well, I, I still got the plank anyways. So we'll just leave. Okay. Uh, they live in the factory and, like, they don't ever go anywhere, so they don't really need money. So, I mean, why not get paid and just the shit they like to just sit around and eat and, on their native home? Why take them from their native home? Like, he went searching for these guys. Well, no, he went searching, as it says in, in that movie, he said he went searching for, like, the perfect way to make chocolate. So he went to, like, Peru or, like, Oompa Loompa Land or whatever. <laughs> and, One or the other. Yeah. So he went there and he was like, I'm just looking for ways to make chocolate taste better. And then he just stumbled upon them and they were like... Oh, hey. Well, Sorry. first off, he taught them English. Because when he got there, they were all like... <laughs> like everybody was. Well, that explains to you why he calls them by going... <laughs> but now that they learn English, he shouldn't have to do I that. I mean, he probably just taught them like... Don't, no. don't dip your fingers in that or something. Like, he just taught they them basic... They sing entire about. songs <laughs> in perfect tune. I mean, with perfect phonics. <laughs> I could have used that diamond, like, really bad. I did, I'm sorry. But they got they were hooked on phonics. <laughs> That's probably that's probably all they have is just the phonics. Oh great! Hold on, we gotta. Okay. <laughs> yeah, get 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 me up here. All right, go on, go on. Okay. But yeah, literally they're like, oh, I have the key. Yeah. These snakes are fast, bro. I was hoping that you didn't die. Like that's that's what that pause was. I was like, is he dead? <laughs> <laughs> oh god. I mean, you just gotta think, man. Like, but they're but they're great singers too. Well, yeah. And I mean, like, but what makes me mad though is that they all have different pitches and voice, so they're all their own individual person. Yeah, they all just happen to look alike. But uh, nobody knows how old any of them are. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, well, I mean, I don't think it really matters to, to Willy Wonka. He just like cares that they don't eat all of his chocolate and stuff. He should. Be. I mean, the point is, how do they procreate? How are there so many of them? They probably don't procreate. They're probably just all there. They're probably just like timeless. It doesn't work that way. I mean, like the the more that you you think about it, there. I mean, I've had a lot of free time on my hands. I've done a lot of Willy Wonka research, <laughs> and like to my knowledge, you have the grappling hook. You're gonna have to take it across there. Yeah, but I'm gonna have to waste that. I had to waste that bucket just, or just the pot. 
Hit him. Hit him. I was, oh my <laughs> goodness gracious. I gotta reset it because... No, no. There's a, there's a bucket right here. Oh. Uh, this is ridiculous. Okay, but anyway, what got me on the topic of Charlie and Chocolate Factory is because the little boy... I'm mad. Well, that's a good way to go ahead in this episode. Yeah, anyway. we're sorry we're terrible. <laughs> we apologize that we're terrible, but sorry for the Willy Wonka spoilers too. If you haven't seen the the ten year old Johnny Depp Willy Wonka movie, there's gonna be that one person that's like really, <laughs> really. Spoiler alert: There's slavery. He was like, I was literally putting it in the DVD player. <laughs> I had just saved up enough to buy that today. <laughs>